Monique told me that I was the winner at charm school, I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh my God, I won? God, thank you! I knew you were going to let me down. I knew you were going to let me down. call an amazing story right there. So, Fiery, why don't you come on up? <laughs> so, Fiery, congratulations. Thank you. You definitely deserve that. So, just tell us, how have you been since the show? Oh my God, dude. Since after the show has been a beautiful thing, but it's been crazy at the same time. Because like, I don't do hair at the shop no more, y'all. Cause everybody wanna come in and talk about the show. Ain't nobody paying to get no hair done <laughs> or nothing. And Mo, let me ask you, during the show, just what changes did you see in Safari from that first moment at the steps going into the house until right here, right now? You know, there was a, brief moment that the cameras wasn't rolling. And when they all came in the house, she stopped and she said, I'm gonna make you really proud of me. And I said, I'm not important. You need to make you really proud of you. And you kept saying, I can do this, I can do this. And then for you to go to that thrift shop and give your last, you are the perfect example of what Charm School stood for and stands for. Thank you, Mommy. Thank you. I want to I say this, too. Um, God put you at Charm School for a reason. You're a comedian. And to be a comedian, you had to experience tragedy. Because only from tragedy breeds comedy. That's the only way you could be so funny. And when you funny like that, I know your heart good because I could see it. I could see it, Monique, and I want to thank you again for being there. Whatever reason, I'm glad you was there. Thank you so much. 